Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about multiplying radical expressions. So if I was given this expression, square root of 3 times 5 plus the square root of 3. Okay. Well, right now I'm looking inside this group. Can I simplify that? No, I can't simplify 5 plus square root of 3. So I'm going to distribute the square root of 3 across. So square root of 3 times 5 is 5 times the square root of 3 plus square root of 3 times the square root of 3, well, we can combine that, right, to be uh, one big square root, and that's square root of 3 times 3, okay? Well, if we, we look at it, that, a um, few ways to simplify it, uh, 3 times 3 is 9, so we have 5 times the square root of 3, that's a weird looking 3, that's a 3, plus the square root of 9, right, 3 times 3 being 9. The square root of 9 is just 3, so we have 5, square root of 3, plus 3, and that's it. There's our final answer. We can't simplify this anymore. Now, some people will want to put the 3 out front, or you know, square five, or 5 square root 3 is already out front. It really doesn't matter. Our final answer here is just 5 times, the square, uh, five times the square root 3 plus 3. So let's recap. We're given square root of 3 times parentheses 5 plus square root of 3. I distributed the square root of 3 and multiplied it to both parts there. 5 times square root of 3 is just right there. And then the square root of 3 uh, times square root of 3 is the square root of 3 times 3, which comes to square root of 9. The square root of 9 is just 3. So again, our final answer here is just 5 to the square root of 3 plus 8, 3.